parents and students, I hope that you and your family are doing well during these unprecedented times. As we continue and begin a new chapter in our Corona way of life, I feel such joy to be able to do it with you. All of us here at Greene County Primary School are so excited to get back into school and to get back into a routine. But even though we're ready, I also understand that many of you, myself included, are concerned and anxious about what this year may bring with the many changes that are happening due to COVID-19. This year presents unique opportunities and challenges for all of us. Our staff is committed though in making sure that your child has the best education possible. So come on in and let's take a look at what all we have in place. But first of all, you have to put on your mask. And as soon as we get in, we're gonna take our temperature. As each student arrives at school, they will receive a no contact temperature check from the kiosk in the front hallway or from a touchless handheld temperature scanner by a staff member. Once the thermometer gives the student a green light, they may proceed on into the school. The red social distancing markers on the floor will remind students to keep six feet apart while in line. These red markers are also placed in each hallway throughout the school to help guide students to practice social distancing as they walk in a line to and from their classrooms, the restroom, and the cafeteria. Transitions will be limited to reduce the amount of time students spend walking in the hallway. In the classroom, students' desks will be spaced six feet apart to ensure social distancing and reduce the number of children in each classroom. Each student will be provided with their own Chromebook they will use to complete assignments on the district's new learning management system, Canvas. A good tiger wears a mask. Parents, please provide your student with a mask to wear to school each day. Students will also be provided with a clear face shield for extra protection. Parents, please also provide your child with a water bottle to take to school, as the water fountains have been replaced with touchless infrared water bottle filling stations. In the restrooms, partitions have been installed between the sinks. Frequent hand washing will be encouraged Pre-K through second grade students will eat lunch in their classrooms, but third graders will come through the serving line one at a time. Nutrition staff will plate all food items and no self-service options will be available. Third graders will eat in the cafeteria while following social distancing. For the safety of all, students will board the bus one at a time. Students will not be permitted to share a seat on the bus unless both students are from the same household. Every other seat will be marked off with tape to ensure social distancing on the bus. Students will also leave the bus one at a time and use the paw print markings on the ground in front of the school to guide them as they form a line to walk into the building. Students are required to wear masks on the bus and bus drivers will also wear masks and have hand sanitizer readily available for each trip. So I hope that eases your mind about some of the stuff that you've seen and we have even more stuff coming. But I do know that this year is going to bring a whole lot of discomfort for all of us and a lot of questions with lagging answers. But I know that it's gonna bring a continued circle of support and love and empathy for one another. Trust me when I say your child has the very best educators and we will all get through this together. <laughs>